Picture this, you're minding your own business, strolling through the vibrant streets of Kingston, when suddenly, bam, you trip over a cobblestone and fall into a time warp, landing smack dab in the middle of 1914 Jamaica. Surrounded by a bygone era's sights, sounds, and smells, you realize you've just hit the historic jackpot. Welcome to an adventure through time, where the past is about to get a whole lot more interesting. We are about to embark on a journey as thrilling as a cliffhanger in a serial novel. Imagine Jamaica in 1914, a mosaic of bustling markets, serene countryside, and the dawn of monumental events. It's a year when the world is on the edge of transformation, and Jamaica is no exception. From the echoes of World War I to the whispers of future technologies, this island is alive with stories begging to be told. But don't worry, we're not here to remind you of the dates and dull facts. No, sir. We're diving headfirst into the tales that make history feel like the latest gossip. Let's unravel the mysteries of 1914 Jamaica, where every moment is a story waiting to be discovered. The call to arms. Can you imagine the stir when World War I breaks out? Jamaica, tied to Britain, finds itself in the thick of it. Fueled by a mix of duty and adventure, young men line up to join the fray. Their stories of bravery and sacrifice are the stuff of legends, etching their names into the annals of history. It's interesting to know that in 1914, Jamaica generously donated 50,000 pounds worth of sugar to support the British cause, while also allocating 10,000 pounds to defend the island. Talk about playing little Jamaica stepping up to the plate. A canal changes the game. Then there's the Panama Canal. This marvel of engineering reshapes the global trade map overnight. For Jamaica, it's a double-edged sword. New opportunities clash with economic upheavals. It's a pivotal moment that tests the island's resilience and ingenuity. It's important to also recognize the significant contributions made by the West Indian workers who tirelessly worked to construct it. These hardworking individuals hailed from Jamaica, Barbados, Jamaica, Grenada, Martinique, and Trinidad. Their blood, sweat, and tears helped make the canal a reality. Garvey's Bold Dream. Enter Marcus Garvey, a man with a vision so grand it transcends borders. Founding the Universal Negro Improvement Association, he stirs the pot of nationalism and pan-Africanism, igniting a fire that would burn bright for generations. Garvey's dream is a beacon for those yearning for change and identity, when nature is angry. Imagine the relentless sun parching the land as Jamaica grapples with a severe drought. Farms suffer, families struggle, and the island faces a test of survival. It's a harsh reminder of nature's power and the resilience of the Jamaican spirit, the sky's new visitor. Amidst all this, a curious sight, the first commercial flight lands, a glimpse into a future where the sky is no longer the limit. It's a small step for aviation, but a giant leap for Jamaica's global connection. Are you hooked on the tales of old Jamaica, loving the journey through history with a twist? Then make sure you are part of our crew. Smash that subscribe button and let's keep sailing through the annals of time together. Trust me, you don't want to miss what's coming up next. The Bedwardites stand. We can't be brief with this one. In 1914 Jamaica, the Bedwardites, a religious movement led by the charismatic mystic Alexander Bedward, found themselves in a struggle for religious and social freedom. The group believed that Bedward had been divinely appointed as a prophet, and they followed his teachings, which included the practice of faith healing and a belief in the imminent arrival of a messianic figure. However, the Bedwardites' beliefs and practices were seen as a challenge to the established authority of the time. The colonial government and the mainstream Christian church both saw the group as a threat, and they sought to suppress their movement. The authorities arrested Bedward and charged him with sedition, accusing him of inciting his followers to rebel against the government. This clash between the Bedwardites and the authorities shed light on the struggles for religious and social freedom that were taking place in Jamaica at the time. The Bedwardites were not alone in their desire for greater autonomy and self-determination. Many Jamaicans were seeking to assert their rights and their identity in the face of colonial rule and a rigid social hierarchy. In the end, the Bedwardites were not successful in achieving their aims. Bedward was declared insane and confined to a mental hospital, effectively ending the movement. However, their legacy lived on, 
and the struggle for religious and social freedom continued in Jamaica and other parts of the world. Festivals and Follies Village fairs and festivals are the social highlights of the year, offering a melting pot of music, dance, and the juiciest gossip. Amidst the laughter and merrymaking, there's always room for a little mischief and romance, making these gatherings the talk of the town. Donkey Derby Delights Imagine the hilarity of donkey races, where the island's unsung heroes compete in a spectacle of speed, or lack thereof. These races are a beloved pastime, brimming with laughter, cheering, and the occasional stubborn donkey deciding it's just not their day. Ghosts and gadgets, tales of duppies and ancient remedies add a dash of mystery and humor to the everyday. Whether it's warding off spirits or curing the common cold with a bizarre concoction, these stories remind us of the rich tapestry of Jamaican folklore and creativity. Rural runways. Lastly, witness the countryside's fashion revolution as new trends make their way from Kingston streets to rural pathways. It's a spectacle of style and innovation where the latest fashions meet practicality, often with amusing results. And there you have it, Jamaica, 1914, in all its complexity and charm. A year of trials and triumphs, laughter and legends. As we step back through the portal to the present, we carry the stories of a past that's as rich and vibrant as the island itself. But remember, history isn't just about looking back. It's about understanding how those bygone days shape our today and tomorrow. So keep exploring, keep questioning, and most importantly, keep watching. Until next time, stay curious, stay adventurous, and always seek the gold in everything. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel, Impacting Jamaica.